keeps coming this way. Wonder if he's working his way over here to go fishing or something in the pond that's over here. Well, he saw us. Well, we got our first hunter kill. Rogue hunter kill, that is. Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I am an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go out and about and uh, continue to try and find the other two hunters. I still have not found them. Uh, but we've done a couple of things uh, since I uh, since the last episode. So first of all, I now have a shirt and some shoes, so uh, or some boots, rather. Uh, so we made those, and then we'll start working towards, you know, the higher-level stuff as we continue on. Um, you know, these two, uh, or rather... I guess we would go for the medium pants and the medium weight shirt. Uh, so we could probably, yeah, we should be able to make both of these pretty easily. We just need to get more cloth, essentially. Uh, so we did that, and then I also put down this little stairwell here, and up on the roof we have our first crop plot. I know that's kind of a jank setup, but it's just temporary. Uh, so I have all my cotton seeds planted in here, and then I also had carrots um, and I just uh, watered and fertilized that right before I started the camera. Uh, across the way there where you see um, that bear wandering around, I also put an animal trap up. You can't see it from here. It's out of render distance. Uh, but there's an animal trap baited, um, and uh, hopefully that will start catching uh, small critters for us. Okay, so that pretty much uh, gets us updated on the changes. Uh, I don't know. It's probably been about a day and a half or so, in-game day and a half, uh, since the last episode. So... I think what we'll do is let's go across here and check our trap. We might have to lead that bear away and uh, look down here for any kelp. I don't see anything uh, close by on this side, so let's cross over. And then we're going to just keep, you know, hunting for the other hunters. I still have not found uh, where their bases are as of yet. Uh, the one hunter that's in the birchwood forest is is building away. They now have an enclosed place, and probably, um, you know, very soon, if not already, we'll have a chest that can be raided. Uh, I have not been attacked yet, either. So there's that. Okay, we have a critter in our trap. All right, awesome. So apparently, this trap does not work on the island. Uh, you son of a. Um, okay, so we have a rabbit. Good. All right. That didn't take long because I just set that up like yesterday, in game day yesterday. Um, so that's great. <clears throat> okay, so let's butcher him. And we got the one piece of cloth. I'd really like that medicinal plant. Um, we could probably kill this guy with a shotgun blast. Um, I just don't like killing bears because they don't, you know, they're harder to kill than wolves and they don't usually give you any more than wolves. I think it's a little unbalanced. Um, all right. Well, here. Let's go back. Uh, let's go back, cook up this rabbit, and we'll just take it with us. And I need to bring some more bait back for the trap. And maybe by the time we're ready to do that, that bear will have moved a little further on. Okay. So for the bait, uh, I believe we can put... It's either two or four of these in. I think it's just two, but let's take four just to be on the safe side. Because uh, that's really all I have. Uh, I don't think one onion, and I know one blueberry won't work. You have to have at least two blueberries um, in there. In fact, onions may not even work at all. I'm not sure. Uh, I did kill a wolf off camera. Um, no, actually, it was, it was a level one bear. Uh, so I have that steak. So we'll eat that first, and we'll take this with us for lunch a little bit later on. We're not doing bad at all, though, on food and water and all that. In fact, we might as well just take some water right now um, while we're waiting for that to cook. So then top that off whilst we're here. Okay, let's eat this now because it is it's getting close. And then we are now good to go. Okay, we'll cross back over here, rebait the trap. Um, if that bear continues to be 
a nuisance, we might end up just killing him. Yeah, he's moving back towards the trap. Come on, bear. What the hell, man? Is there any uh, kelp around here? You can't use kelp in the traps. But you can use medicinal plants. I just don't remember, like I said, if it's two or four that we need, so we'll find out. It's too bad it doesn't work on the island, man. It would have been a lot easier. But I guess, uh, you know, I've never seen a small animal on that island, so I'm sure that has something to do with it. Here, let's get this ready just in case. All right, let's split this in half. Nope. Oh, uh, is it three? It's three. Okay, so it takes three of those to bait that. Fine. Okay, that works. That works for me. All right, let's go around these critters here. Um, I did make my way fairly far north uh, two in-game days ago. Uh, if we look at the map here, you can see that I went all the way up to here, but then I turned around because it started getting, you know, on in the day and I didn't want to run all that way back at night. So we are working on, you know, uncovering the map too. Uh, it's important to do that, of course, because um, then we can tell at nighttime where the hunters are actually located. But if they're in the fog of war part, then we still can't see them. All right, we got an ammo crate here. Give us some shotgun shells, please. No, but we will take nails and arrows. All right, we're not going to go down that way. Um, I don't think I'm going to grab that copper for now. What I need is iron. I don't think you ever do not need iron in this game. It's pretty much constant all, all along. Ooh, another ammo crate. Okay, let's grab this guy. More bullets. Uh, uh, rifle rounds, rather. That's good. That is very good. Oh, I did make a lockpick, another lockpick, too, so we have that as well. Just FYI. So we came down through here, I think the last time you guys were with me, and we found some rogues, but they should be gone by now. We've got some strawberries and some carrots. I'm not really in a position yet to start, stay, uh, start saving the strawberries. Um, maybe a little bit later on in the in the late summer, I'll be able to start doing that. But right now, I I just need to eat them for carbs because we got to stay on top of that. Okay, I believe those hunters were down there and they are not there. So those were rogues, of course. So we don't got to worry about them anymore. Uh, well, we don't have to worry about them in that spot anymore, I should say. Let's grab this ammo crate here. Magnum rounds and rifle rounds. Beautiful. All right, let's hit this grub tree. Okay. We have another crate up on top of here. And it's an ammo crate. Okay. You can see um, how far along the hunters are now over there. Uh, it's quite possible that they already now have a chest down with some stuff in it, but I'm going to give them a little bit more time before... We go say hi to him. I am expecting an attack at any time, but I'm starting to wonder if being out on that island is maybe messing that up a little bit, which is not really what I intended, even though it's convenient as I'll get out. Want to make sure we don't get too close to those guys. We got a a wolf here. Um, I'm a little bit close to the hunter base to be using my guns, though. I'm not a hundred percent sure if they can hear. You know, if you're within a certain range, if they can hear it or not. Um, yeah, let's uh, let's just leave that wolf be. See if we can find one that's a little further out. I am starting to kill level one wolves now, uh, in addition to bunnies and chickens and the usual.
Man, this is the day for ammo crates. Look at that. No shotgun shells, though. Another one. All right. How about shotgun shells this time? Nope. Very cool. Okay, so we got a bear down that way. Let's keep kind of moving in this direction so we can... What I'd like to do is kind of uncover the perimeter of the map and then start working down the middle. You are a level 3 wolf. Let's leave you alone for now. Got a building crate and another copper. Oh, no, this is a medical crate. Medical food crate. Now, that's pretty good stuff. We'll take it. Um, we can try to get this copper. It might upset the wolf right behind this big boulder, but let's see what happens. I did make another pick for when this one breaks. For whatever reason, God and cold games only knows there's a dude. Uh, we can't repair picks. I don't know why, but we can't. Alright. I'm pretty sure that's going to be a rogue. Don't want to waste ammo on him. He keeps coming this way. Wonder if he's working his way over here to go fishing or something in the pond that's over here. Well, he saw us. Well, we got our first hunter kill. Rogue hunter kill, that is. Fortunately, he's far enough away from his camp that I don't think his buddies were alerted. Yeah, okay, that's that's okay stuff. It's not terrible. I don't know if it was worth a rifle round, but... Or did we get a rifle round from that? <laughs> I don't remember now. Okay, um... Let's see. There's a ammo chest right there. There's a wolf right there. I'm just trying to see if I can get a sense for where their camp might be. Might be like up on the other side of that boulder. Okay, yeah, I see them right up there. There's two more of them. Got some arrows, that's good. Alright, well, we're not going to be able to map out that area with them there unless we decide to just go kill them. You son of a bitch. Stupid eagle. I was busy watching the hunters. You stole our kill. <laughs> Bastards. Doity rants. We could probably snipe that guy from here. And get his buddy coming after us. But if we... That wolf's... A potential problem. Okay, we got another rabbit and then a black bear a little further up. I wonder if that eagle's up in its nest. We could shoot him out of the nest. The nest is right up in there somewhere. I think it's, uh, I think that's it, right? No, right there, yeah. Hmm. All right, let's pick our head up over the ridge here. Oh, well, we've been detected. Okay, two down, and we still haven't been hit yet. Oh, shit, hold still, you bastard. Oh, he killed us! Oh my goodness! I did not think that was going to happen. Oh, that is super unfortunate. And it's going to be really interesting getting our stuff back now. Alright, do we have enough power to uh, buy a spawn? Yes, we do. Oh, boy. Okay. Uh, I knew I was bleeding, but I guess... You know, the thing is, is I don't have any armor on. And, uh, you know, that's a big factor. I'm... 
I need to pay more attention to, to my health. Uh, but let's see if we can get back there and get our stuff and then get our revenge on that guy. Good for him, though, for shooting us. Uh, actually, no, he sucks. <laughs> we probably lost ammo and shit. Ugh. Hope we didn't lose our lockpick. That'd be the worst thing to lose. Yeah, I gotta I gotta watch that health because um oh we need to go this way. I don't don't have the armor on that we had in season one towards the end. You know, I was just used to being able to take a couple of hits and then not being that big of a deal, but that's not the case right now. So yeah, keep an eye on that health. Get those bandages and health packs consumed as soon as you you know get damaged like even the first time. Don't mess around with it. That's our motto now. We learned our we learned the lesson and let's so hopefully it'll hope that it sinks in. Cause I you know that was my fault. I could have I could have taken that many pack and we sh we should have been able to take that guy out. But just uh you know trying to get used to being in the early game again is what it really amounts to. Base beacons established. It's probably those guys up there. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Well, hopefully some of these crates we're looting along the way back will help replenish whatever ammo the death penalty decided to inflict upon us. Okay, we're going to have to get around this wolf, but there's a bear over that way, too. Shit. Okay, let's crouch. Okay, the wolf is now pursuing us, so I'm going to run him around over this way. Okay, there's a bear right up there, so let's see if we can cut back through this way. Uh, I think the wolf stopped tracking us. Okay, so let's just very quietly sneak around this way. we got to get to our stuff as quickly as possible. Um, hopefully this guy's not at the campfire and he wandered off again. If he is... Then we might have to run in with the axe and see if we can melee him before he kills us. Unless I can get to my stuff on time. Okay. And then this is... Oh, he must... Uh, oh, no, he's right there. Okay, we got him. Okay, so let's see. What's the damage? Um, we still have nine rifle rounds. We don't have any extra shotgun shells. We have 23 pistol rounds. And we still have our lockpick. That's, that's the most important thing. Uh, so it's not, not too bad. Could have been worse. Could have been worse for sure. Let's eat this and let's eat this. And everything else is back in its normal spot except for the bow needs to go here. And yeah, okay. Let's butcher you so I can get the hide even if the meat goes bad. And I think we're back in business. Okay. Yeah, that could have been worse. Um, <clears throat> it wasn't ideal, of course, but... It's just the way it goes sometimes. Um, ooh, we have some liver that wasn't even burned. We'll take that. This Is this the guy that we just blew out? I think, yeah, because the other guys would have despawned by now. All right, well, the good news is that <clears throat> we can now map out this edge of the, of the map. 
are uncovered, I guess I should say. Um, so let's keep going this direction for a little bit. It is starting to get dark, so we need to start thinking about heading back. There's the eagle's nest. Um, but we won't be able to get to that until climbing picks, which is going to be a ways out where we can afford those. All right, so we got a bear and a wolf down that way. Let's just kind of run along through here. We get a, a little bit further up from here and we'll start getting into cougar territory. We are not ready to mess with those guys yet. Here, let's put this down here. Okay. We're good to roll. Good to rock and roll. So there's a bear down there. Now you can actually go up through that way and get around um, the backside of the mountains going through here. Um, it's a very cold route, as you can imagine, and there's not really anything there, but it is doable. I did it in Season 1. We're not doing that right now, of course. There's no reason to, but just FYI more than anything. Okay, we got a wolf up here. Let's see what level he is. Level two. Um, I guess we could kill him. Okay, got him right before he got us. We don't want to get an infection. I do have an antidote back at the base, but base is kind of a long ways off. Okay, we got a liver and a cloth and a fat. Um, I think I'll turn that liver into a second antidote when we get back to the base. I got all the other stuff for it. But we do need to start thinking about moving back there because it's getting dark. Just trying to map out a little more territory here. Let's cross over here. That's a chicken. Get those mitts washed. And we'll start kind of coming back along the this little river here. Wolf down there. Let's go this way. I think there was a bear somewhere around in this area, so we got to be careful. We must be careful, you know. There's a strawberry. Oh, yeah, there's that bear right there. Okay, let's go this way. Shut up. Quit your belly aching. An onion. If we had a little bit more time, I'd probably go diving uh, for seaweed and pearls, but I think we need to get moving here. Aw, oh, shit. How'd that mess? Okay, let's 
Let's go. Let's head them up, move them out. There's some ore over there, but again, I think we need to get moving. I think that was uh, phosphorus anyways. Or, uh, I mean, potassium. We can't get phosphorus until we go down into the cave. Which will be a while. Got some in-game stuff there. Level 2 bear. Okay, let's leave him to his own devices. Their fire's still burning up there. <laughs> you know what we could do is we could go back up there and cook our meat. Uh, we don't need to do that. Let's just go. All right, you guys. Well, it's a, it's that point in time in the game where it's super dark. I can't see shit. You guys can't see anything. So I think I'm going to let you go here, but I'll keep the recording going in case something crazy happens between now and the time I get back to the base. Otherwise, uh, we will start up the next episode at some point in the very near future and continue the hunt for the other two hunters. I really want to know where they are. Um, and, you know, we'll, we'll find them eventually. And yeah, so thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. It is so dark. I can't see a damn thing. And we'll see you in the next one. That's the chicken. Bye.